welcome back to my channel yes mama we doing it today honey we got the look what do you think to my hair today are you loving it are you into it girl i filmed a vintage hair tutorial which is coming very soon or it's already out girl i'm feeling myself with my hair like this honestly i'm not even lying to you so what are we doing today honey we are doing a vintage clothing haul pre-love thrifted haul girl you know me i like a bargain i like to be out in the thrift shops and the charity shops looking for high quality for low prices so you already know i'm here for this what do we have we're here and we have the rona right now so a lot of these places are closed and we can't go anywhere so what am i doing instead i'm looking on ebay uh, looking at all these thrifting online places that i can get yes i know lauren you have a problem yes but i can't help it i love it and i just i love fashion and i'm really trying to upgrade my wardrobe this year i decided go through declutter it's all about quality over quantity so i'd rather have less items that are higher quality but girl we know we are on a budget so we always looking for high-end things on a budget i feel like i said that eight times anyways with that said I just want to get into this haul because I want to show you all the great bargains that I found. We're going to start with this coat. Now, this is a gorgeous coat, really nice. It's a long coat, so it looks really, really cute. I am going to be doing a little fashion show at the end of this video, showing all these items off. But this coat is gorgeous. Look at the detailing in the fabric. And the buttons are really cute. I just found this. It's really, really, really nice silk lined. And let me see. What brand is this? It doesn't even have a brand in it. I don't even know. Oh, wait. What's this? I feel like this logo is like the Wool Company. I don't know what it's called. Wool something. Does anybody know what this logo is? If you know, let me know. But really, really nice. I think I picked this up and this cost me... I've been looking for a coat like this because it's classy, it's elegant, it's glamorous. And I just want to be stylish in my coats. And I think I got this for about £9 or £6. Um, really, really nice. And again, this is... 10% cashmere and the rest is uh, virgin fleece wool or virgin wool. So it's cashmere and wool coat for that price like hello and next gorgeous dress okay mama can we get into this how stunning is this dress honey so stunning look at this detail here like the see-through mesh I absolutely love this. I think it's stunning. I think it's gorgeous. This is by a company called Forever Unique. If you know, they got really bougie dresses, really high quality, really fancy. Uh, and I won this on eBay. And I won this for, I got this dress for £18, which is really, really good because this would have been very expensive, brand new. It's really nice kind of shimmery gold color. But it's really nicely lined. How is this really nice? It makes your body look amazing. And this is just such a cool design. I, I initially loved this kind of beading here and the see-through mesh part. Gorgeous. Next is a, another dress. Now, girl, this dress, I can't believe this came up for sale. I remember seeing this on The Only Way is Essex years ago when Lucy Mech was engaged to... Who was she engaged to? Mario something. Oh, this looks so cute. You <laughs> <sighs> had a good day. It's been amazing. How do you try? Anyway, look at this. Can you believe this? How stunning. Look at the back. It's a low open back. So look at the beadwork on this absolutely gorgeous so gorgeous and if you remember seeing the episode i love the design on the print of it as well you can see it's like this do you remember they were on a private yacht probably in marbella or somewhere more than likely and this is when 
Mario proposed to Lucy. Now, if I can find a clip from this episode, I'm going to insert it. But she was wearing this dress. I remember seeing it then and I was like, <gasps> and I think she actually worked for, this is from Forever Unique as well. So I think she actually worked for Forever Unique. So they just gave her loads of dresses. But girl, I remember seeing this. I remember looking on the website and it was like £300. And I was like, girl, no ma'am. Can't be buying these. And then it came up on eBay, practically unworn. And I was like, okay, I'm a bit on this. Hopefully I win it. And I got this one for, this was for 19.99, so 20 pound, which is a great saving. Um, some of you might be like, oh, that's not in style, but I think quality items and just, you know, this is timeless. It's, a, it's this is a statement dress. This is a statement dress. So I love this. The next thing I got is another dress, honey. And it's, it doesn't look that great on camera, actually, to be fair. But it's just a little short dress. Um, really, really cute. Just kind of goes on. This would be nice in the summer. It's like off the shoulder kind of moment. Really nice little sleeves. This is from AX Paris. This is actually brand new. Like, it still has the tag on it, which I was quite surprised at. So, obviously, someone bought it and never wore it. So very happy with this. And this was $12.99. So not, not, it's not bad for brand new as well. That's quite good. The next thing I bought was this green blouse. Now you can't really tell what it looks like. So I'm going to insert pictures here, but this is a Zara lookalike. This doesn't actually fit me. My boobs are too big. Problems. So I'm going to have to give this to my sister or I'm going to try and set it on. I'm not sure, but I paid £10 for this. But it's really cute and I'm looking for something like this in a size that'll fit me. So yeah. Next item is this gorgeous red trench coat. Now this is just a staple that I do not have. I do not have a red coat but I do now. And it was this red coat. This is from Wallace. So I don't even know. Is Wallace still around? I don't know. But this is just really nice. Like the back is just, it's just nice. I wanted a red trench coat. I wanted a staple trench coat. I'm looking for classic staple items. And this just fit it for me. And I mean, this is basically, all these items, people take really good care. They're basically like brand new, which is crazy to me. So I absolutely love this. And how much did I pay for this? I'm not 100%. The red coat, I paid £13. Can you believe it? £13, girl. The next thing I got is this hat. Really cute, it's a vintage hat. Um, I thought it'd be really cute, especially in winter, you know, like giving me those kind of vibes. I'm not putting it on properly because my hair gives me those kind of vibes of like princess, like in the snow, feeling the warmth, living my life. Love this. And I think I got this. Yeah, it's really nice inside, that silky line. I think I got this for like four pounds, something like this, like four pounds. So really good bargain. Next thing that I got, now this was actually a gift from my boyfriend and we found this. Now the seller just says red is not her color and she doesn't want it anymore. Oops. So we found this and girl, the seller just says she doesn't want it anymore. Red's not her color, she's never gonna wear it. And I was like, oh my gosh. Now we already have this this particular item in grey and it is the Louis Vuitton Logo Mania scarf and I finally got it in the red with the silver. How stunning is this? And I got this for, I won't believe the price, she's selling it for £50. I was like, girl, I will have these. I do not care. These are such, and look at the insides, wow. These are such delicate scarves though. Honestly, if you catch it or pull it, it pulls and you have to like try and adjust it with these. But they're really, really nice. These are 95% wool, 3% silk and 2% polyester. Um, so you can see here the label and things. But I love it. I love how reflective it is on the inside. My other one is just like a matte one. But um, yeah. Feeling the fantasy vibes, the Louis Vuitton vibes. And I found this on eBay, by the way. So most of the thing, all of this was bought on eBay. So I love it. Super cute, worth the money. 
Thank you, babe. And now the last thing that I got was... Now, girl, this is... I wanted these for this vibe. But unfortunately, they don't fit. They're too small. And that is these kind of trousers. I really want this, like, long sort of wide leg grey sophistication, like, trousers. But they don't fit. So, sad about that. But they are cute. Um, so, again, I'm either going to try and sell these on, give to my sister... Or I'm going to try and donate them. But it's such a shame because these would have been so cute. But, oh well. <sighs> That's it now, guys. So, I hope you're going to enjoy the fashion show I'm about to put on for you. So, let's go in three, two, one. <laughs>
watching. I really appreciate you coming around and saying hey girl. And if you really enjoyed it, be part of the fam and hit that subscribe button. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye guys.